Hello, Mr. President. It is an incredible honor being able to address you through this brief video segment. The letter has been made as a means of asking you one specific question. Before I ask it, though, I wish to first make it clear that the issue has nothing to do with you personally. I happen to be a huge fan of yours, and your presidency means a tremendous amount to me. As a matter of fact, I even designed a limited edition pair of sneakers just to celebrate you. First Lady Michelle Obama and yourself both own a pair of them all. I, for one, believe that your being elected was the will of the all-knowing being. I can sense that all-knowing energy in your person and in your way of handling the mission that has been given to you by the American people. All that being said, a situation exists that I still have much difficulty understanding. I really wish to know your genuine opinion about it, Mr. President. I and many others of my generation need to know your take as clearly as possible on the topic. I'm just trying to reconcile in my head my strong beliefs and strong faith on one hand and on the other, the issue that I have and which exists right now in, the, in America. The question I'm alluding to, Mr. President, is as follows. What can you, as President of the United States of America, tell us about the mistreatment, the killings black people have been subjected to lately. On far, far too many occasions, a white police officer can single-handedly decide whether or not an African-American person will be able to live the next second. Seeing this now routine situation, I'm under the impression that America has taken a huge leap backwards, back to its old demons, namely, slavery, with perhaps a slight modern twist added to it. You're not just any president. You are the first and only American president who represents both the African-American community and the white community. You are black and you are white, both. The perfect representative of both peoples. What can you tell us about this appalling situation whereby white Americans are in a position to regularly despise and crush African-American citizens. Perhaps I have missed something on your part, but I have been expecting much more of a response from you. We need to hear more from you. Is there a conflict within you holding you down? Our expectation is certainly not that you favor one community over the other. With all due respect, I need to hear from you. What can you tell us here? Is there anything you have to say to us about this? Thank you, Mr. President.